Alright, hello and welcome to another vlog. Like, yeah, literally we've just finished doing Madame Two Swords. Unfortunately, as you, some of you may know, you can't film inside any of the dungeons attractions at all. Uh, I might give you a little review when we come out, but straight away I'll, I'll pop this straight into the, uh, the tower experience, which we'll be doing next. That's literally straight next door as well. Uh, there is a circus and other things to do in there, but you have to pay extra for that. We are literally just doing the uh, the uh, the tower experience, so the tower eye, I think it's called, something like that. But yeah, we're doing the London Dungeon. We've done this one before, and it's really good. You've got the uh, the drop ride at the end. There's a few um, same sort of similar um, attractions as the other ones. You've got the Plague Doctor and that, so you've got the tower drop as well. So yeah, we're about to go in again. We've got the ta the tickets for this one as well. But yeah, you can't film inside here. So yeah, I'll see you when we come out. Right, so that's it, we've just done the uh, the drop tower. And then uh, following us around, some guy came up, all right, Andy, I'm gonna spot it again. <laughs> yeah, right? that's what's your name's? Uh, I'm James. James uh, and Kieran. Kieran, yeah, we, and you got picked on, didn't you? Yeah, I think you, you both did, didn't you? Yeah, yeah. Really, really enjoyable though, that, it was really good attraction. Yeah, good attraction, yeah. Drop tower was good as well, surprisingly. Yeah, it's yeah. awesome, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, really yeah. good. What would you say was just, like, the best scene out uh, of them? I enjoyed the um, courtroom scene. Courtroom, yeah, they're yeah, always a classic scene, funny. aren't they? Yeah. yeah so. Yeah, all of it in general was really good. Yeah. Than I thought it would be. Uh, I thought it'd be more like a, like a child's attraction, but it's good for the adults as well. It is. It's not bad actually. It's it's actually one of the least scariest ones. Mm -hmm, uh, Warwick's quite a scary one. Uh, York, I've been told, is one of the best. Yeah, Obviously, you've got London and Edinburgh as well. So yeah. yeah. But yeah, it's nice to meet you guys. Yeah, nice you Are you well. doing anything else today or? Uh, probably get off now to go. It's quite long queues at like Madame Two Swords yeah. and that. So yeah, yeah you look, you sound local. Where you're from? Preston. Then. Preston. Yeah. Uh, so it's easy. Yeah. Well, yeah. Not far from uh, not far from Auckland where I used to live. But yeah, nice to see yeah, some more fans you. of the channel. Yeah, see you later, guys. entertainment on over there. Wow, it's loud as that to say it's across the road. Right, we're just on the dungeons next door. Now we're going to the Blackpool Tower. Right to the top of there. We got some good views. It's pretty windy now. But uh, not as bad as what it was predicting. Like I said in the Blackpool vlog, it was supposed to be in 70 mile an hour wind today. But uh, no, nothing, nothing at the well, it is windy, but not as bad as it should have been. You got the love. Blackpool Tower level I. Level five. Level five the tower I. Yeah. It's Harry Ramson's up there. Well, lifts out of action, we've got to go up the stairs. So we've got to go up level five. Yeah, a long time ago, before Merlin bought this out, the tower was actually a whole one thing. You know, you had it all. You could go in the ballroom, you could go in the circus, but now it's all extra now. Beautiful old building. Dino Mini Golf. There used to be a ride in here as well. Oh, going the wrong way. Yeah, there used to be like a, a dinosaur ride as well. That went ages ago. Yeah, beautiful. Alright, so. Since it's the afternoon, we just stopped and had a nice drink there. Blackpool Tower Eye with the 4D experience. Again, it's been a while since I've actually done this. And um, yeah, it's really good. I mean, here, yeah, this the original, well, the original, it's the supports for the tower. It goes all the way to the bottom and the circus is built underneath all of this. It's amazing, really. I love all this architectural stuff. I mean, I'm into be building and construction anyway. So I like all this sort of stuff. I still really like to go to Paris and go up the Eiffel Tower and stuff. I've been to Paris a couple of times a long time ago though, so I never managed to actually do anything like that. Oh, they're off to the toilet. But yeah, you've got Harry Ramsden's here, which is a famous fish and chip shop brand in the UK. 
and uh, then we'll be going up the tower which I think just round here so yeah Harry Ranston's if you want some uh, fish and chips come get me here right so here we go into the attraction first of all again the uh, standard photo points there which we don't tend to do and just a few things of Merlin attractions and things there and we've got a 4D cinema first and then uh, then we go upstairs but yeah you get the uh, ballrooms a separate thing as well now it used to be included but we've got to pay for that where the uh, Wurlitzer is and things are but yeah it's really good this we'll get up the tower obviously can't film in the 4D cinema uh, so I'll see you when we get into the lift oh more pictures more pictures Right, oh, so we just come out of the cinema. It's really good actually, it's got music by Kylie and it's, yeah, it's just 4D cinema. You get covered in water, you get covered in um, foam and all sorts of stuff. Yeah, the tower actually opened in 1894. So we'll be going up to the tower in a minute. Here's some of the beams just here as well. There's a lot of history with it and it's amazing. There is so much history with Blackpool itself with the Pleasure Beach and everything else that he's got. It's, it's amazing, I, I really like it here. Princess Diana opening it as well. Yeah, I really like, uh, I really like the tower. And the whole of Blackpool, in fact. But yeah, there's the lifts that take you up the top. I'll uh, see you when we get in there. A minute, exactly a minute to get to the top. It's quite busy in there. There we go. Yeah, it's quite busy tonight. It's amazing, you, you really can see quite far into the distance. You can see uh, Barrow just over there where the ship shipbuilding yard is. The Lake District, I mean the view is absolutely stunning. You, it really is. They couldn't have built this tower anywhere else in the UK. Uh, you can see Eastern Power Station just over there. Yeah, I'll get some more footage. See Morecambe Bay from here as well. Basically, just out uh, over there. You can see Heesham Power Station. You can see the Lake District. The Lancashire Pennines just here as well. It's an amazing view. It really is all the way around. It's stunning. So if you look on these interactive things as well, you can see the Isle of Man out there. Yeah, we're sort of 
look at that one there. to the next section now. I say there's even a bar in, in here as well, bar 380. 380 degrees. We've got the uh, stairs. Right, just apologise now, it might be you might get some wind noise on this. Woo! Uh, look, it's still quite a bit to go up there. There's Lisa. Wow, amazing, I love it, I love things like this. Things that are high up, I would really like to go. Paris and go up the Eiffel Tower. Whew. It's very windy. The Winter Gardens just down here. <laughs> it is windy. Amazing view, right? I think a lot of you probably wanted to see where uh, Blackpool Pleasure Beach is. Blackpool Pleasure Beach just down here. Oh, it's lovely on this side. Oh, there's no wind at all here. It's lovely. See, so, yeah, Blackpool's just Blackpool Pleasure Beach just down there at the end. See the big one. I right, see so you can see everything here. It's amazing, yeah. I hope you've enjoyed these vlogs for the past couple of days. Blackpool Pleasure Beach, uh, Madame Two Swords, obviously, can't film in the dungeons in here as well. So, you've got uh, South Pier just over there, Central Pier just down here, and uh, North Pier just behind us, Coral Island just down here as well. We've done a vlog from there before. Uh, yeah, it's quite a busy place. I can see the car from here. <laughs> Beautiful, beautiful day now. Really nice. Oh, it's windy around this bit. Wait for the wind. I'll have to go up to the next section now. I'll take a few pictures. I think this is the highest point you can go on it. Eh? Oh, you can go up here as well. Yeah, when they, uh, they re re um, renovated the uh, the whole tower, it took it took them seven years to repaint it all. Because it was actually, if I remember, well, you, could, you could used to go that bit as well. They painted it like a gold colour for like the Queen's Jubilee or something. And then they painted it back to this original brownie red colour as well. Yeah, Very windy in this section. Thank <laughs> you. 
and the photos taken before the cinema today and you'd like to have a look at those the desk for that is straight ahead when you exit the lift all you need is the white card to give them when your photos were taken before the cinema and then to the photo team at the desk there and they'll handle the rest just around the corner from there we do have the gift shop where we do have a wide range of different souvenirs and gifts on offer so it is well worth having a little look before you exit just in the far corner and that'll take you down to level five when you start your gifts today now down there you'll also find our Costa coffee shop jewelry gyms and any cams or push chairs that you may have left down there if you do have any final questions, then do feel free to ask us anything, but otherwise I'd like to thank you all very much for visiting. Um, if you do have a couple of moments to let us know how your experience in Tara has been today, our customer feedback point is located just outside the gift shop exit. We do appreciate all the feedback we do you receive. Maybe a team member made a difference to your visit, or maybe you came out there as week. No, before either way, we'd love to hear from you. Other than that, everyone, I hope you all enjoy the rest of your day. Thank you very much for visiting the Blackpool Tower Ride today. Right, that was pretty much it. Uh, just exactly a minute to go up and a, a minute to come back down. There's your pictures and things if we got pictures while we were there. You got your uh, your merch and stuff in here, your little Blackpool Towers, which is pretty much that one you want. I don't know why you'd want to get a silver one. But uh, yeah, it's like I was saying, yeah, they end, ended up painting it. Got, yeah, YouTube, yeah, yeah, she, I don't think she wants to be on it. Um, you got all these medals and things like that. But yeah, no, I really like it. It's, it's a great addition, you know, to come and be able to go up the tower. Pretty much like if you went to London, you got the dungeons there, the sea life, uh, and the Orlando, Orlando Eye. It's not even called that now, it's called Icon, isn't it? But uh, yeah, you even got the uh, the London Eye as well, or the Coca-Cola Eye. This, this everything is like a whole package. But that's it, we've pretty much done it. I'll get some more footage out from the outside. We'll cross the road and have a look up and get you a bit of footage from there. But yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this one. Something different, I like doing these different vlogs. I might even get a Blackpool uh, Tower magnet. Right, that was it. Just want to get, it, uh, get it some footage from the outside. Yeah, it's, it's awesome, I love it. Uh, like I said, opened in 1894. It took them quite a few years to build it, really. The circus is in there, in the bottom of it, located at the bottom, and you got all this stuff to read down here. I mean, you can see it from all up there. You can see the glass tower from here. Right, we're, we're actually going now. We're going into Coral Island. Uh, the girls want to go on the slides for a bit. I'll probably do the ghost train in there. I've got a film in there, because you're not really allowed to. Um, and I've already done the ghost train before as, a, as a, like a, an attraction vlog so I hope you've enjoyed this one um, don't forget to leave a like and a comment and uh, nice to see you to see you nice I'll see you again bye for now